Derek, my brother. Frankie, what's this about? I've got to say, I'm nervous about this little meeting. Shit, when I heard you was back, I nearly shot myself. Sit down. Why didn't you call me? You could have slept on my couch. I'm doing real well for myself, real well. I'm sorry about how life turned out for you. That thing? Our friend did what? 37 and 8? No. Huh, <laughs> what about them swingers? How's Marlene? The kids? Beautiful. Okay, yeah, I gotta go. Let's chow. Hey, Ray, so, uh, who's the pal? Phil, you remember Nico? He's a good friend of mine. Can we talk? Sure we could talk, as long as we don't talk too much. Interesting times, you know what I mean? Did you hear about our friend, the guy with the thing? Yeah, you mean Harry the... guy with the hat? No, the guy with the, you know, the... but the beep the poop. Yeah, the guy with the... and the... Yeah, that guy. Yeah, I heard. So be cool, Ray. Listen, I need to speak to you alone. Yeah, Phil, see, that's the thing. I kind of know what you're going to ask, and I can't. What do you mean you can't? I can't do it, Phil. I got a lot of interest right now, business is really taking off, and I don't want any distractions. Well, as you could see, I got my own issues here. Look, Nico is good. He'll do what you need. And you say he's a friend of yours? Sure. Good to meet you. Yeah. Come here.
The triads have this big chunk of brown they're desperate to get rid of, talking about it all over town, wanting to offload it at any price. They think it's cursed or something. Prove it is. Take it from them. It's loaded into a truck going to Franklin Street and West Dyke. Get a hold of it and give me a call. Sure. But Mr. Bell, it's going to cost you. You got it. No problem. Great. Say, nice stereo you got there, Phil. Thanks. Yeah, so, Philly, you ever hear from your ex-wife? What kind of question is that? Just ask it. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Every time, this motherfucker. Mm. I'll be in touch, Nikki.
I'll be in touch, Nikki. for the ride, but you make the car smell a big shit. I've got the 
complained about your driving gas hole. Phil, man, I got that thing you were after. What do you want me to do with it? It's a wedding present for my nephew, Frank. Take it out to the big house for a big bad enemy. You know the one I need. Mean. He'll be waiting for you. Yeah. Hey, you Frankie. Your uncle asked me to give you this wedding present. You're a lucky guy. I don't know about that. I gotta sit on this stuff until Phil gets over his paranoia and we could ship it. Meantime, I gotta pack it into some cars that go faster than this thing. Sounds like a fun honeymoon. Later on. Matthew's got his wedding present. Nicely done. He's a good kid. He deserves something special. Hopefully you'll look after him. Nico, you looking for more work? I'm always looking to earn a bit of extra cash. Great. I know a guy who needs a man like you. Only operates on an outside line. Go to the payphone on the corner of Petulo and Hartman. The coin. Roman, it's Nico. I need the cab. Nico, I am sorry. Has he got work? Yeah. He's got stuff that needs doing. Head over to his house off of Beaverhead and Westside. Welcome to Burger Shop, motherfucker! Bon Appetit! 
motherfucker. Thanks for coming in the burger shot. Stay calm, it's only a bike. Forgive me, but I need this. Forgive me! Where can I go to buy razor sharp knives, swords, flails, battle axes, and jewel encrusted medieval double handed flaming swords of death? The serrated edge. Hey, buddy! Get this crap moving, will ya? To protect your so can you? Two blades! I can't get any closer than this, so I have to drop you off right here. That was not my first thought when I heard. I'm happy for him. Sure you are. I'm happy too. Fucking happy. Bruce is ecstatic, homie. Just, you know, kinda gonna, gonna, gonna miss him is all. He's not going anywhere. Him and Mallory are only getting married. We all have to settle down sometime. What, you think I'm getting old? I got the abs of a 17-year-old gymnast and the forehead of a toddler, baby. Brucey don't need to settle down just yet. Sure, sure. Enjoy all that extra pussy then, Brucey. I'll see you around. What's wrong? Nothing, sweetie. Oh my god. You're the lucky one. What? You could slice cheese on those puppies. I must be the only slob without cheekbones. I'm thinking of getting implants. But you sounded hysterical. Oh, sometimes I can't bear to be alone. I'm so glad you've come back into my life, even if you did try to kill me. I'm so excited. What are we doing here? We're going to have fun. Fun. Yes. It's a four-letter word, I know, but we can still try. Look, more people want me dead than alive. I'm working for the Mafia. The police and the government agency are both on my case. I kill and steal to scrape together a living so that my cousin can fritter it away online.